This is Sarah, Diane, and Jake from Cook with Five Kids. And today we have a really cool new science and art kit. It's called Just Add Milk. And all you need to add to this kit is some milk. So today we want to show you the first experiment. It's called Magic Milk. And we have already prepared our plate. And this plate has plain milk poured on it. And we're going to do one drop of each of these food colorings. And then we are going to put one drop of soap and see what happens. Okay, so first we're going to do one drop. Diane's going to help us do one drop of each color. Ooh, the orange made a perfect circle. That's pretty cool. One drop of orange food coloring. That was red. Sorry, sorry, that was red. Now the orange. So the orange just made a drop and didn't even move. Oh, now it's starting to move a little more. Okay, next. We have green, and we're going to separate all the colors, like the instructions tell us to. One drop of green. Green was small too. Green was small and stayed a perfect circle. It's kind of interesting the way the colors all are different. And now the blue. A drop of blue. That one stayed a good circle too. Okay, so now we're going to put one drop of soap onto our toothpick. And then we are going to touch it to the surface and we're going to see what happens. Whoa, what happened, Diane? It moved all the colors away. Here. When you touch the color with the soap, it pushes all the color away. It's really and then interesting. It goes back. And then it goes back. It jumps too. That is really cool. So what the instructions tell us And they don't want to touch. They don't want to touch, right. See, look, each color see. doesn't want to touch each other, do they? It looks like a big parachute. Look. So what, yeah, it does look like a parachute. So what they're trying to tell us is that the surface tension on the plate allows the liquids to resist forces from the outside, just like when a water bug strides across the water. But it also means that the molecules that are the same, like the milk molecules, cling together very tightly. But the soap is able to weaken the bonds that hold the proteins and fats together in the milk. That was really a cool experiment. And look how pretty that looks. What does it look like? Abstract art. It looks like abstract art. That's true. Okay, so what we're going to do next is we are going to take this plate of milk colors and we're going to make a picture on it with a piece of paper. So we have this heavy paper and we're going to press it down on top very gently onto the Play. Try it. Try pressing really gently, not too hard. We don't want... Whoa. That was pretty cool. Do a little bit more. Do a little more. So this is the milk and food coloring that we made with the soap. And we're going to try and make a picture with it. So we're going to take a piece of very heavy cardboard and we're just going to lie it on top of the plate of colors. And we're just going to kind of like move it around a little and then hold it up and let's see what you made. Ta -da. Pretty cool. Maybe we soaked it a little too much. Yeah. And this was the one that we just made a few minutes ago. I think that one was a little better. That one's pretty cool. That was a little better. And it says with this kit you can use these ideas to make greeting cards, posters, tie-dye designs. You can make so many things with this simple thing. And the